Here's what else is happening. A Stark County mother accused of faking her 11 year old daughter's terminal illness is now going to prison. Lindsay Buckingham has the story and explains why the mother took a plea deal. It's all over Lindsay Bull's Facebook page. Fundraiser flyers asking for money for her 11 year old daughter Riley. But in May of 2021, that all came to an end when she was accused of faking her daughter's terminal illness and taking thousands from the community. Thursday, in a plea deal with the Stark County Prosecutor's Office, Abul pleaded guilty to one count of child endangering and one count of theft. She was sentenced to four to six years in prison in order to pay over $8,000 in restitution to her victims. In a statement, Stark County Prosecuting Attorney Kyle L. Stone said the plea brought closure to all parties in the case, stating this was also the best way to avoid the possibility of further traumatizing a child that has already been through so much. A Bulls attorney, Paul Kelly, released a statement on her behalf, saying, in part, it's very important to understand here that this child did have diagnosed medical maladies, including a lesion on her brain. This is fact, and the records exist to prove it. However, Kelly went on to say that Riley's ailments were later proven not to be life-threatening, and in order to avoid a trial that could have resulted in a nearly 20-year prison sentence, she pled out. Now, Lindsay Abdul will report to Stark County Jail this January. Her lawyer tells us if she has good behavior, she could be out in six months. Meanwhile, her daughter Riley is said to be living with her father and doing well. Russ? Mm, okay, Lindsay Buckingham, thank you.